Hi guys, welcome back to the channel here today. Uh, I'm doing a bit of a POV style video. We are out here at Wolf Lake. Look how beautiful this is. It's freaking awesome out here. It's got the lake, got the dog out. She's running around. Got down here in the Jeep, hoping to get back out. Uh, we're gonna continue further down and see how far we can get brought a shovel just in case we get stuck in the recovery gear so should be all right all right let's continue on oh, just absolutely beautiful out okay I did try and air down my tires a bit but don't really like I, I need to get one of those uh, tools where I can air down where it all kind of airs down at the same time and I get the exact PSI but anyways we're already in four low um, I am just gonna stick the rear lockers on once I get a little up here I think actually I don't think we'll need it just on four low as you can see the left side is telling me it's too much too far down but That's just a safety thing. So, we're just gonna wheel on back up. Actually, a little slippage, but you know, we got down here. We're actually the only ones that came down here today. It's just absolutely beautiful out. So one thing about wheeling by yourself is you don't wanna get stuck in places you know you can't get out. So like for instance, we're just gonna turn right here. There we go, look at that. So today, like the snow is soft. The snow is all soft today. Uh, it's not frozen. So say if I came back tom tomorrow when the snow is all ice packed and cold, um, you know, that's more risk for getting stuck. So days like today where I know I'm fine in the Jeep, um, this, you know, I can go out on days like this by myself. Um, I do have straps in the back in case I were to get stuck somewhere, you know, a lonely traveler might come and help me out. Um, but I don't really need it to be honest with you. So let's go down this way. One way road, so. Tried to get out yesterday when the snow was kind of coming down, but um, I didn't really get out, fortunately. Got, got about halfway. All the snow is falling off the trees. Uh, that could be kind of dangerous. Um, trees falling down sometimes. Snow getting a little heavy, but she's actually not bad. She's going pretty good today. I'm not really nervous at all, surprisingly. Going out by myself, it's <laughs> first time. Okay, we're on our way back down. Hope you guys can see everything. Got the camera in a good spot. I almost sold this GoPro. I'm kind of glad I did not. But yeah, this is about halfway to the little river uh, Lost Lake down there but we're not gonna go down there today the snow's getting a little deeper and so that's about as far as I'm gonna wheel today I'm gonna probably stop at the little lake area here and maybe just have a gander with the dog maybe she wants to eat something or drink drink some lake water river water it's a tractor it looks like they might be doing some logging out here which sucks every time they do logging they gotta block all the access points off and everything else it's kind of frustrating when you like wheeling. <sighs> Anyways, I got a lot of freaking snow up in my brake calipers. <laughs> Tons of snow sitting in them.
I don't know what's squealing back there. Something squealing. Anyways, we're gonna keep it in four low. We're just gonna rock down. It's a little river crossing again. My, oh yeah, heads up, I am getting a drone um, quite soon, so. I'll be able to drone this stuff as I'm crossing and and just get some aerial, uh, you know, views of me doing stuff in the Jeep. It's, I'm pretty stoked on it. Spent also starting my own cinematography business, so there's that as well. All right. This thing is having no problems. <laughs> I could keep going, but I'm not. This thing is having zero issues. Mom's like, don't get stuck. was the snow. I took some snow out of the sticking in the brakes because I was a little worried if I don't know maybe that froze it would have done something to the tires but then it got stuck. My rear lockers got stuck for some reason. I couldn't get tearing them off so I was kind of a little worried. I'm like was something frozen back there? Why is why is it stuck? Uh, whatever. I did turn them off, so I might try this with them off. send it no rear lockers it's not icy at all either so oh yeah no problems all right let's skirt up here at it hopefully it don't get stuck skirt Oh yeah, no problem. And we are out. All right, I'm gonna start heading back. Um, but yeah, let's head back, back to the mountain. Release. Let the dog play in the snow, hey? Yeah, go we'll play in the snow. Hey, Harlow, want this? Want the ball? Snowball? Go. She loved, my dog Harlow loves <laughs> snowballs. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take some pictures, pop this out, take some photos. All right, so I decided to take a different trail back around. Um, I forgot to put my um, SIM card back in the GoPro, so we're just gonna cruise with the camera right now. Um, just beautiful out right now. I think I might just stop and take a fucking another photo of this, the trail hawk and the trees. I think it just looks so good, <laughs> so beautiful out. Give you guys a bit of perspective on how the snow is currently right now. Still got a ways to go, but she is fairly, she's deep out here today. <laughs> So we're gonna continue up. So beautiful out. I haven't really encountered any downed trees. There's just some trees that are pretty low. But we're doing pretty good out here. So we have encountered a problem here. 
and the snow is getting fairly, fairly deep as further we go up here. So I'm gonna back all the way down, turn around down there, and uh, yeah, we're gonna not go any further. <laughs> so deep. All right, we're going back down. Didn't get stuck at all, so that was, that was good. Gave her the beans to get out. Now we're just gonna head back down the trail, back onto the main, uh, I guess, we're Duncan Bay, Maine, and head back. Um, I wish I had a saw or an ax or something like that. I could have got rid of that tree, but um, this side, this road is a little further up uh, the mountain, so it was getting quite deep out there, and I don't want to risk getting stuck, fully stuck at least. Now, if you guys are wondering, like, what are my thoughts on this Trailhawk for off-roading, um, I love it. Especially in the snow. I'm gonna rip up that little hill there and come down on the other side just for fun. Cause, you know, why not? <laughs> why not? It just crawls with ease. It's just, there's no issues. But yeah, we're, we're not gonna go up there cause it's further up the mountain. We're gonna keep going down. Though I want to go up there. But snow's, you know, getting deep further the further I go up. See, we were just down here earlier. Alright, so I did end up trying that trail that I said I wasn't gonna do. <laughs> and I got stuck at the top completely. So I tried backing down and I almost slipped right back into the ditch. So yeah, that was fun, but now we're just slowly backing down the trail and we're just gonna continue back on the main road, but it was fun. All right, well, let's get out of here, shall we? I'm gonna go hit this puddle hard. Whee! All right, we're back out on the main trail now. Sun's starting to shine, no more snow. Um, I am just gonna cut it there, I think.